Welcome to my channel, I am Miss Nekopon. Here's another Breath of the Wild tutorial. Today we're going to talk about locations of your horse's saddles and bridles. There are a total of six sets to collect. Stable, Travelers, Knights, Extravagant, Monster, and Royal. I will put timestamps in the comments below so you can find the ones you're looking for easily. Starting with the stable saddle, that's the first one you get when you first tame a horse. Next, the Traveler set is summoned through the Link Rider Amiibo. Both of them will be summoned at the same time, resulting with two chests when it's scanned. It's not guaranteed, so you might have to do the scan over the course of several days. Next, we have the Knights and Extravagant sets, and they're both found in mini games in the Lake Tower region. First, let's talk about the Knight set. You can find it at the end of the road here. Find the man under the tent named Genie. Make sure to arrive mounted on a horse. You'll need lots of arrows for this one. In order to get the knight bridle, you need to get 20 targets, and for the saddle, you need 23. My two quick tips for this is to use either a swallow or falcon bow because of their range and quick draw. Also, I highly recommend using a single bomb arrow at the end of the course to get all five targets at once. Next up we have the Extravagant set. You can find this mini game by talking to Blin at Highland Stable. <laughs> the goal here is to jump through all 10 obstacles with your horse. Finish in a minute and 30 seconds to get the bridle, and then a minute and 15 seconds to get the saddle. I wasn't able to do the 1 minute 15 second run with a 2 speed horse, so I recommend lots of practice and or a faster horse. Make sure to avoid those electric keys because you'll fall off your horse. <laughs> Let's talk about the monster set now. In order to get this one, you need to venture deep into Akala region. And there's a shady monster businessman there called Kilton. I'm not sure if we can engage with him before you do these quests related to him, but he's located at this location on the map. After you engage with him for the first time, you'll have to track him down again at some random towns at night to actually start a transaction with him. But he should be pretty easy to spot since he's in like a giant colorful balloon. Talk to him again to start trading in monster parts for points. You use these points to purchase your monster saddle and bridle set. You need 299 for the saddle and 399 for the bridle. Finally, the royal set is from a side quest called the Royal White Stallion within the Central Tower region. This quest also bleeds a little bit into the Ridgeland Tower region, but that's not very important. Talk to Taffa at the outskirts stable to start the quest. He will tell you to tame a white horse on Safula Hill at the blue marker here. When you arrive, you might have to search a little bit because it's a giant field on foot, and, but you'll eventually run to the white horse. There's also a memory nearby at the horse statue if you haven't gotten it yet. To tame this horse, I recommend at least three stamina upgrades or some stamina food. Sneak up behind her very quietly and mount her. The moment you do, just keep smashing on the L button, which is soothe. After several soothings, the horse will stop fighting back and you can ride her back to the stable. Register her at the stable and then talk to Taffa again, and you will be rewarded with the royal set. That concludes my guide for collecting all the saddles and bridles for your horses. Thanks so much for watching and I wish you the best of luck in Breath of the Wild. See you all next time!